Final score this evening, the Mocs uh, 74, Mercer 61. Head coach Bob Hoffman joining us now. Coach, if you would, give us uh, your analysis of the game, please. Uh, just a hard-fought, great college basketball game and a good atmosphere. They're a good team. Got a great coaching staff. We we had opportunities, and we were right there, and we got in foul trouble the first half, and it carried over the second half and it really hurt us. TJ played well, and uh, we just, you know, they did a good job of switching defenses, and I thought our guys – Got to the right spots, but uh, you know they're a good team. Oh, they're yeah. they're a, they're a experienced team that's been together. They understand what they're wanting to do. These, you know, they were playing for a championship, so were we, and uh, they got us tonight. Um, but it was a really good college basketball game. If we had a couple shots go a different way, yeah. uh, we were right there. And that's on the road. That's what I told the guys. You can't miss free throws like we did, yeah. and you. And you can't be out rebounded like we did to have a chance to win on the road. And you mentioned, coach, the free throw shooting. Uh, boy, sometimes they just don't fall. But 12 of 23, that's 11 possible points. Uh, some of those the front end of a one and yeah. one. But uh, boy, that that makes it twice as hard to win on the road. Yeah, it does. And and uh, the guys want to make them. Yeah. I mean, they want to win. They want to win at a high level. They would just didn't. Find a way to get it done tonight. I think our team's just as good. We hope we get to see them again in the tournament. We had a great uh, bus load plus over there. You had the entire section behind you, Mercer fans. I think the name is getting around, the Mercer name in the Southern Conference, that uh, when we come to your house, we're going to bring some fans with us. Yeah, I appreciate all the people that made that happen. And uh, I know that's a big sacrifice of a lot of people's time. Uh, it's not an easy drive. And uh, it, it was huge. I mean, it was huge. It gave us some energy. We were right there. We got in foul trail. I probably should have put guys back in or some guys back in in the first half and see if we could have played with two fouls. But I just worried some – we just hadn't done a very good job of that earlier yeah. in the year. Great college basketball game tonight. We didn't win it. Um, tremendous atmosphere. Our guys battled like crazy. On to uh, Birmingham, Coach. Uh, after we defeated Sanford at our place, they went on a row. They won five in a row. So we've got our hands full on a Saturday afternoon as well. Yeah, it's, it, it's, it's no doubt about it. They've been working all week. The schedule, again – doesn't favor us in the conference. Uh, we've had a lot of strange things that have worked against us, but these guys have shown up and worked their tails off and believed at a high level, and we still believe something good can happen for this team. It's not over yet. Uh, we, we lost to a good team tonight, mm -hmm. and we're playing a team that's been as hot as anybody on Saturday in Sanford. Uh, they've done a great job. On to Birmingham now. The Bears played Sanford. Remember now, local time at 6 o'clock on the tip. Uh, Eastern time, that 7 will be on there at 6.45 for pregame from Sanford on Saturday evening.